All right, it is negative four degrees outside. Let's see how much range the Model Y and the EQS SUV have when it's this cold outside. We are in the Mercedes EQS SUV. Let's go ahead and do a little range test and see how it performs at these types of temperatures. So we want to simulate road trip conditions as best as possible. So we've driven the car for about 35 minutes or so to get some heat into the battery and to get some heat into the tires. Uh, normally when you're going on a road trip, you would have your car plugged into a charger. It's probably been charging all night. You've probably been preconditioning the interior so that it's nice and toasty when you leave. So we want the interior of the car to be nice and warmed up. We want the battery to be nice and warmed up and we want the tires to be a little warmed up too. So we want to best simulate real road trip conditions. And right now we are sitting on a fast charger. So we're gonna plug in for about 10 minutes or so, just get a little bit more heat into the battery and then we're gonna begin the test. Okay, so we're on the highway right now. We are cruising at 70 miles per hour. It is currently negative one degrees Fahrenheit. We have the interior set to 72 degrees. We'll see how our efficiency does. Okay, so we just finished our little efficiency test in the EQS. It is zero degrees and we got 496 watt hours per mile. 496 watt hours per mile translates to about 218 total miles of range at 70 miles per hour at zero degrees Fahrenheit. So it's not too bad. It's a big hit from how much range the EQS gets in the summer, but I think anything over 200 in the winter is pretty, especially well below freezing, is pretty awesome. Okay, so we are at a Tesla supercharger in the Tesla Model Y. It is negative four degrees outside. We uh, just drove around for about 30 minutes to get some heat into the battery, to get some heat into the tires. Um, we're gonna charge for 10 minutes to simulate as close as possible to road trip conditions where you have the interior of the car preconditioned, the tires are more warmed up, the battery is more warmed up, and then we're gonna go ahead and run the Model Y on our same efficiency loop and we will see how it does. All right, so we just finished our efficiency loop in the Tesla Model Y. We got 428 watt hours per mile at negative four degrees, traveling 70 miles per hour. So at 428 watt hours per mile, that translates to a total range of 175 miles in the Tesla Model Y at negative four degrees and at 70 miles per hour. 